Hey, what's up guys? I'm Anto and on today's episode, I'm going to introduce you how to eat a 5,000 calorie diet and still maintain a slim waistline in the process. Uh, so today I'm going to start with my first meal of the day, my breakfast, which is two hash browns, three bacon strips, a full avocado, and half a cup of egg whites with a full egg and some spinach. Now, I made the calculations uh, how many calories this, this diet, well, this meal is, and then I can show you how I calculate my meals in order to reach my 5,000 calorie diet in a healthy way and still maintain uh, a good thin waistline or thinner than usual waistline and still be able to eat what I want, how I want, and when I want, which is the most amazing thing anybody can ever do is not deprive themselves of anything that they enjoy in life. So with that said, bon appetit and let's get ready to eat. All right guys, so <clears throat> very important, when I first wake up in the morning, what I do is I uh, take my lemon squirty squirt, and I put it in a uh, bottle of water, which I, as you can see, I drank. And first thing I do on an empty stomach, I chug that down and uh, drink it. Mm. Oh yeah, don't forget, women find syrups, this is good stuff, zero calories. Uh, so yeah, I checked out what that does is it helps me break down my foods from the night before and helps my digestive tract and just basically flushes everything out for me to start my day on a brand new page. Huh. So, with that, also don't forget, <clears throat> I do take my proper supplementations. What I'll be taking today is my kidney supplements. Because your kidneys always have to be properly filtered, especially when we're taking in 5,000 calories a day, seven days a week. That's seven times, so that's 35,000 calories a week. Not counting my cheat meals uh, that I, I will have on weekends. Because uh, weekends I surpass 5,000 calories, I'll eat like 12, 12 mini vanilla fluff cakes or 12 donuts. Plus a Big Mac and whatever, you know. Uh, then I have my L-carnitine, which is very important, which I keep mentioning, and my vitamin E. With that, I have my omegas, which is very good for your heart. And another trick to uh, trapping fats in your body, uh, excess calories and not storing them as fat, is CLA. CLA, my friends, this is magical. CLA and L-carnitine, three times a day uh, before each meal. I am telling you, it works wonders. Okay, uh, then I got my zinc, my magnesium. Vitamin D. The D is very good for you guys, very healthy. Then I got my vitamin B and my ginseng. And that's it, my vitamins are taken care of. Never take vitamins on an empty stomach, that's why I ate a little bit before uh, eating, taking my vitamins because I couldn't get painful in the stomach area. Oh. Mm, so I like to put it all in one plate. Makes a nice mix match. Mm. So, let me get to the stats of, of this breakfast and explain to you how this meal, which seems pretty satisfying, a lot of people say, oh my god, if I eat all of that, I get fat. Incorrect. What you're gonna do by eating all of this is get really happy. Because this is very tasty for your taste buds. So, <clears throat> the eggs, one egg is 80 calories. The egg whites is 90 calories. The bacon is 105 calories. The, uh, the hash browns is 220 calories. Along with my avocado uh, is another 200, uh, my avocado is another yeah, 220 calories. And I have 160 calories for my, no, my avocado is 160, and then I got another 20 calories for my spinach. So, total gives me 675 calories for this breakfast. Which is pretty good, considering that for some people it's a pretty big breakfast, but for me, in two hours I'm gonna be hungry again. So, 
it's a relatively small breakfast but super super enjoyable and only 675 calories which is amazing because that leaves me roughly well it leaves me actually 4325 calories left throughout my day which means uh if i am in a calorie calorie deficit deficient if i'm in a calorie deficit excuse me it's hard to speak while i'm eating i can permit myself to eat a bit more of some junky junky food without getting fatty fatty which is usually where i'll throw in like that burger or those donuts or whatever it is i can even throw in that extra meal if i want to but if i'm missing a thousand thousand two hundred calories by the end of my day why not have it with something that i love <laughs> it makes no sense at all so that's how i do it using calorie deficiency in order to splurge and still maintain a proper shape another secret i'm going to share with you guys today which helps with maintaining a healthy and balanced system which allows me to keep on eating the way i eat and not get morbidly obese believe it or not that is the secret of sorry eating with my hands it just tastes so much better the magic secret of the cucumber well prior to this meal as soon as i wake up i have my mm, my lemon squeezy squeezy water with my cucumber so i eat a full cucumber a day i cut it in half i have half in the morning as soon as i wake up with my lemon water and then i have the other half at night before bed to help me digest and flush out whatever excess foods i have now do not eat a massive meal right before bed if you're gonna eat a huge huge meal have it at least three four hours before bedtime uh, just to avoid indigestion um unnecessary stress on your heart and your body mm. so let's go take a look at what that cucumber can do for you so i took the time to do some research and write down all the sets of this magical vegetable so in no particular order and i did not pre-study this so we're going to be finding this out at the same time i just wrote them down without really registering or analyzing what i was writing just looked up the healthy stats to feed my body and to feed our brains with the proper knowledge of what's going in us to build these little biceps okay <laughs> so first and foremost it is a hydrating vegetable it is 95 percent water and lo and behold our bodies are also composed of uh, 70 70 75 percent water aids digestion hence why i take it early in the morning helps my digestive tract in order to take in more food throughout my day flushes out toxins uh, especially when you are eating 5,000 calories and I'm not eating 5,000 5, healthy calories per se uh, in, throughout the entire day. So when I'm eating those donuts and those burgers, that cucumber will help me flush out the bad stuff that comes with the good food. <laughs> also, reduces cholesterol. Now, if you're splurging and you're shoving things down your throat, which I do on a daily and I love it. So if I don't want to suffer the consequences of my guilty pleasures, I want to reduce that cholesterol and keep it low. Along with the omegas, which also helps reduce uh, cholesterol. Very healthy for your heart and your brain and your blood circulation. All right, regulates body temperature. When you're eating a lot of food, your body is in overdrive. Uh, so you want to keep your body temperature down. You don't want to overwork your body because then you're going to break out into a fever. You'll eat less, you'll perform less. 
just all in all you won't be as good it's just like a vehicle when the engine is overheated the car either stalls or does not perform at its maximum capacity and we want to perform at our maximum at all times yeah okay so promotes hair growth well, hey had i known this at a younger age i'd start eating cucumbers from birth but i don't know why it makes your hair grow but you know ironically as i've started eating cucumbers more frequently lately my hair is growing at a quicker pace i did have my head shaved to skin and this is only a month's worth of growth so that is freaking fantastic but i also noticed that my gucci gucci is getting bushy bushy so you got to be careful with that guys make sure you stay trimmed and ladies and humans uh, just pets you know just stay trimmed in the proper areas if you want to and if you don't want to then well stay wild and out there as much as you want let's get crazy oh okay fantastic okay let's keep on moving so after the hair growth regulates blood alkalinity which is freaking fantastic because so does this and the more your blood alkalinity is controlled the less likely you are to have cancer cells develop in your system so it keeps it low which is fantastic so the longer we do this the longer we live the longer we live the more we eat the more we eat the more we enjoy the things that we enjoy doing in life and share the love with one another because life is all about loving all right cool it promotes joint health tack 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 especially when you are heavy lifting or just moving a lot in general up and down picking up your kids putting them down whatever the case may be you want to have those healthy joints and i ain't talking about that i'm talking about this right here keep that healthy boys and girls and humans let's just get it done okay perfect relieve sunburns i don't know how i don't know if you have to rub that cucumber all over yourself to relieve those sunburns or if you gotta eat it whatever it is try both try maybe rubbing it on your face and then eating it or eating it first and then rubbing it on your face or your sunburn wherever it may be but if that's the case just do it try it seems like it works hey. okay fantastic soothes muscle pains that's why i'm never in any pain whatsoever and these guys are ready to go locked and loaded on a daily because that cucumber gives me the energy and lack of pain that i need to keep on pushing through fantastic so heals diseased gums please go heal those gums guys and girls and humans because there ain't nothing worse than somebody that's got nasty gums and nasty teeth that is awful do you ever make out with somebody with a nasty mouth it is gross okay oh, nasty okay fantastic builds connective tissue because when we train we are destroying our tissue so we want to rebuild them so we can get back bigger and stronger and we want to also keep on eating this because it regulates blood pressure and when i do eat a lot my blood pressure or anybody's blood pressure can go up so this helps to keep balanced just like myself i am perfectly balanced all right and also last but not least extreme extreme rich in vitamin a b1 b6 c d fluorine calcium magnesium and potassium mind blown so why why would you not want to eat that cucumber because it doesn't taste good well i don't care honey buns do what you got to do so that you can keep on doing what you enjoy doing all right guys so that my friends for today will be my little healthy diet hack secret to help you guys maintain a healthy shape and a healthy lifestyle while eating the things you love to eat and never, ever deprive yourselves of the things you love. Because life, my friends, is too short to not be filled with, with love and passion and fun and happiness. So guys, with that said, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy this episode, please click that little subscribe button. And next to it, there's a little bell. So when I do make new notifications, new posts, you get that notification. I always have trouble with that. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And remember, peace, love, and anto.